playing in, in Jerry's World at and Stadium. As a player, do you get excited about things like that? Oh, definitely. Um, playing the biggest games on the biggest stage, it's a blessing, first off, foremost. And just coming here every year and playing in the playoffs is also another blessing. So um, we're excited. I can't wait to go out there and play our life. What is it? it? I mean, is that one of the reasons you come to a place like Clemson? You've played you know, Orange Bowl, Fiesta Bowls, national championships. Definitely. You come to Clemson playing big games like this, uh, knowing they're going to be playoff contenders every year, um, knowing that they're going to be the best teams in the country. Uh, just coming in here and competing, uh, winning the starting spot, and then also playing in the big games, big lights, um, national attention. That's what you come here for. At what point do you start thinking about your future and whether to come back to put your name in the hat for the draft? At what point do you start thinking about that? Um, I really don't put too much thought into that. Uh, I focus on the next game, the next opponent, um, worrying about this year and whatever comes next year. Um, that's in God's hand, not, not in my control. Uh, so with that being said, I will talk to my family, things of that nature. So. I just let God handle all that stuff. We just worried about beating Notre Dame and going to the national championship. Come on, you talked about you know that you guys come here to play in big games. You played a lot of these games. You guys know what it's like to get ready for. How, how much of an advantage is that when yeah, yeah, facing a team like Notre Dame, really which backs, has not uh, been uh, involved in this in a few years? Uh, every game is hard. Uh, every week. The teams play us the best, uh, no matter who they play previous, uh, they, they play us the best, and they, they go hard, um, they, they get a little extra hype when they play us, so um, every week is challenging, so we just continue to come out and prepare. Um, each game is the biggest game, this is not just the biggest game because of the playoffs, it's always been that out mentality, um, each and every game, even we play Fairman. Even when we play Jordan Southern. They got the same mindset. Every single game is a big game of the year. Is there a comfort level in your mind, though, when you guys <laughs> come here in December preparing for this? It's like, hey, you know, we've been through this before. I mean, we know what we have to do. Yeah, when you prepare, um, that comes with confidence. When you prepare as hard as you can, you know that you you, you did all you could uh, to the give your best. Way, and that's, that's all Coach Sweeney asked for us, our coaches asked for us. Um, just go out there and give us our best. What do you know about Notre Dame's uh, offense? Yeah, I think so. Uh, um, they got a lot of playmakers. Uh, well, uh, they they, they get the playmakers the ball, things of that nature. Um, down, but, uh, we don't know. These guys, uh, you they never these guys really played us, so uh, whatever they throw us, we're going to be ready. Uh, we've seen Notre Dame's already kind of playing the disrespect uh, card. They're the underdog. The Nobody gives them a chance. Does that matter, though, when the game starts? No. I mean, you've been on the other end of that. Does that matter when the game starts? No. Uh, like I said, they're going to play us our hardest when we play them our hardest. So, um, made the best man win, basically. How do you feel about the secondary and where you guys are going into the postseason? <clears throat> I feel like we very prepared. Um, like I said, early in the year, um, they feel like the secondary is a weakness. Can continue to try us. Uh, we had two bad games, especially for me personally, um, for South Carolina and Texas and them. But, we just had a game where we had only five yards passing on Pittsburgh, so we can show that we can go out there and play. I'm super excited. Uh, Say it again. I can. Short, rhythmic passing. Seems like Ambrose likes to get the ball out quickly to his receivers on the outside. That's a safety. So I'm excited. Just being in a position where Coach Venables put me in to make plays. It'll be cool. Each and every one of me, Tanner, AJ. In the Mullen, and um, their all the secondary guys, just around. listen to what the coach says and go out there and execute. That's all we can do. You know, you can play a good game in front of him. That's pretty good. So, uh, I'm very physical. Um, I like to push off and things of that nature. So we just got to bring the physicality right back at him. Did you make um, mistakes? I always heard there's always like state competition. So you did steak and then cleaned up some of the things like. I mean, yeah, preparation, man. Uh, just working on your weakness. Um, if you strengthen your weakness, it strengthens you as a player. Being, being that type of athlete that don't have that many weaknesses, it's hard to defeat. Uh, so just stressing on our weaknesses and what we did bad versus circling the game so we can better ourselves in the future. Do you feel like you've 